guys, Matthew here. Today, I'm gonna try to solve a Mega Minx one-handed. So, this will be a challenge because unlike a regular cube, like a two by two or three by three, uh, it's a duo decahedron and like it's so much harder to move pieces around. Unlike your three by three, you can just do that. And two by two is a little smaller, but you can do the same thing. So that's why I think that this is a challenge because you can't really hold it the same way as you'd hold other puzzles. So before we get into this video, don't forget to like it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to share this video with all your friends. And don't forget to hit the notification bell for all my future uploads. So, without further ado, let's just get into the video. Okay, so yeah, I got a new mat, and also I just hand-scrambled this puzzle. I got, I got like, well, it's not really a new mat. I just like found some, something that could be like a mat at like a dollar store and then just cut it up. But yeah, it, it works as a speed cubing mat to drop your puzzles on, and yeah. So I just hand scrambled this thing and yeah, I'm just gonna start inspection. And then once I lift my hands off the timer, uh, it starts, I guess. So yeah, so I think I'm gonna do the white star. I think, yeah, that, that seems like the best star I could do. Okay, see, this is, this is like what I'm saying when it's hard. I mean, like, you can turn layers like this. You don't really have to lift up the, the cube to make any turns, but it's still a hard challenge because you can't really grip the puzzle well, one-handed. And, like, your arm moves are going to have to be, like, your fingers instead of your pinky, and that's, see, like... That, that was a little bit of a reach. So yeah, I'm timing this solve because like I just wanted to know how fast I, I can possibly do it one-handed. So about at this point, I'd be like on my second or first like face of S2L, but one-handed, I'm not even done star plus F2L. So this this might be like, a long video but but I don't know it's already been a minute and I'm not yeah it's probably gonna be a long video so guess how long it'll take me to solve this mega minx one-handed because I I'm gonna guess about seven minutes seven minutes is my guess so you can just comment your guess down below in the comment section or you don't have to, it doesn't really matter. I just wanna know, I just wanna see what other people think, cause I, I already upload like my road to sub one on Mega Minx. So you know what I average two handed, but like, I just thought this would be like a fun, calm challenge. And so I'm on my second S2L pair, or S2L fate. Wait, no, my first S2L face. So, yeah. Dang it, that's such a hard thing to do. Um. So, yeah, got that done. Now I can just insert stuff. So, that's a good pair, and I can see this one. So, Oops, I just shook the camera a little bit, so. So, I think, like, U4s are faster, or, like, R4s are faster when you do it like that. And I have to do some very awkward finger tricks to even, like, get this, these moves or something. Like, these are not good finger tricks for one-handed. The only thing I'm doing is, like, thumb. Thumb and index. 
I mean, I probably could do other things that are better, but like, this is the, these are the only things that come to mind. I don't want to do that. So, yeah, um, it's already about, it's three and a half minutes. I don't know how much longer this will be. My guess was seven minutes, and I think it's going to be slower. I just think it's going to be slower, no particular reason, but I just, this is not a great... Um, a great time to be at. So, um, oh, oops, I just lost grip on that. So, um, yeah, Mega Minx, you don't, you, I don't think you should hold your Mega Minx when you do it one-handed. Just keep it on the table, cause then it'll be like a solid place to, to to like grip it, and then like you hold the top, and then you do your turns. And yeah, you won't have the same kind of grip strength if you just held it in your hand like normal, one-handed. But okay, I actually don't know like full or full Tula oil on Mega Minx. So I'm just doing algs that I, that I recognize and then I'm just doing this, like just doing two algs to solve one case. Okay, so I'm almost done. So this is a J perm. Think so hard to do this. Why? Okay, and now I'm doing my beginner thing. Okay, yeah. Doing the beginner. Wait, hold on. Yeah, so this is probably not a good way to insert stuff. Um, wait, yeah, okay, almost done. Wait a second, no, I messed that up. You're kidding me. Wait. No, I didn't. I don't think I did. Okay, so that time was a 6 minute 36 solve. So, yeah, I that's about three times what I average because I average like high ones, low twos. But yeah, I think that was a pretty great one-handed Mega Minx solve. And if you want to see more challenges like this in the future, don't forget to like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to share this video if you think that it was a good video and want other people to watch it. And don't forget to hit the bell to never miss out on my future uploads. Like, in the next few weeks, I'll be uploading like just weekly my normal upload schedule and yeah i'll see you guys next time and peace